Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's been a while since I filmed a video and I'll go into that into my co and chat which I will be filming very, very shortly. Um, so this is my colouring book haul for December. I only got one, two, three, four, five, six, eight books, two of which are Ava Brown PDFs. Um, because I didn't get much, I got one book for Christmas and I didn't get any supplies. So, because of Christmas, expensive time, don't have a lot of money to spend. Same as in January, I've got Paul's birthday and Jennifer's birthday. So, <laughs> January promises to be just as sparse as the rest of them. And I'm trying to cut back on spending because I've got a lot of books. So the first book was Ava Brown Pinup Models. I love this. I have done one from it, which you'll see in my very sparse completed pages but I really like this book and I want to do more in that one very very soon it's kind of like a grayscale so that's really cool like it and the other Ava Brown was Whimsical Beauties I haven't done one in this yet but I do plan to soon because these are really cute really really cute now it's very mild here in the UK in Wales at the moment I've got a fan on because I'm warm and I've got the window open, so people are going to hear me talking to myself and think I'm crazy, which I am, so that's okay. So those two were given, they, they were sent to me free as part of the Ava Brown launch team. And like I said, I haven't coloured in that one, but I have coloured in the other one. And I will be colouring in that one shortly. I bought 50 Christmas mandalas, colour by number by Sachin Sachdeva, because I wanted some more colour by number Christmas. Because I only had, what, two of them? really like that I've done a couple in there and you'll see those in the wrap up and this is Christmas Patterns Colour by Number by Prachi Dewan Sachdeva I've done one and I've got a whip which I will be finishing off in January January is kind of going to be my whip month to start with I'm going to have a, a whip, whip, week or two of whips and then I might start some newer ones but there's that one then we've got the Colour in Heaven Gods and Goddesses special. I haven't done flip throughs of this. If you do want me to do one, I'll happily do one. I can't really get into it anytime soon. These are by Jashley. I do love Jashley's art, but I just can't see me get into it. They're so in depth. I love that one. And that one. I think that they, they are beautiful. Uh, it's just having the time. I got so many books. And I've had so little time to colour, unfortunately. And I've got Relax Without Christmas Special again. I never had a chance to colour in this. I'll explain all about what, what went on. I love the Christmas pictures in here. So it will be coloured in at some point. Then we've got the Colour in Heaven Collection Special well, Collection one, which is the one that's not part of the subscription. And this is Flower Girls 48 Floral Beauties by Mayim Uga. Oigari and Anastasia Coldariva. Coldariva. Again, stunning book. Absolutely gorgeous. How beautiful that is. Very nice. I do like them. Some flower girls pretty. Peonies. Absolutely love them. Look at that. Look how beautiful it is. So yeah, it's just a matter of getting to them. And the last book, I said it was a very small haul this month, it's barely three and a half minutes long, is Amazing Mythical Creatures by Camilla Angel Cova. And this one was given to me by my mum. Amazed that she actually knew one I didn't have because I didn't give any colouring books this time. So unless Chris went, found my old wish list link and went in and saw it. I like that one, The Sphinx. Harpy. I love these. these, they are really good, so it's got a little bit about each one. So for instance this one says, that one's a nine-tailed fox, but on the back, let me have a look, of each one, so this is the Sphinx, it tells you what it is. It says, in ancient Greek mythology, Sphinx is a female mythical creature, has a body of a lion, wings of a bird, the head of a beautiful woman. The Sphinx is reputed to be very wise, mysterious and treacherous. She's said to have no mystery to those who cannot answer her riddles, and the latter are being killed and eaten by the monster. I wouldn't call her a monster, she's a god. There you go. So, if you want to flip through any of these books, please let me know. I will happily uh, do one, but it's a very quiet month for me on colouring and actually buying colouring books for once. So, I hope to see you in the next video. We'll get back into doing some um, colouring. We'll go back. We will be doing that very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.